Hi guys, it's Stacy from Clothes Live On and welcome to my channel or welcome back. If you are new here, I am a full-time reseller on Poshmark, eBay, and Mercari and obviously full-time means suffering right now. We are in the middle of a pandemic and my sales are definitely down, but you know, I'm just pushing through. I know that eventually this will end, could be a while. Um, so I'm just trying to, you know, focus elsewhere and I feel like a really easy thing to focus on is learning new brands. So I wanted to bring you guys a bunch of bolo videos during all of this because we don't know how long we're going to be in this quarantine time. And um, dresses are actually a category that can give you a lot of money. So we are focusing on um, be on the lookout dress brands that have an average selling price of $90 or more. I feel like that's a really good price point if you are sourcing online right now since um, most thrift stores are closed and even if they're not closed, you should not be outsourcing right now. We are supposed to be practicing social distancing. So um, these are gonna be good brands to try and find on sites like ThreadUp or the Goodwill shopping online site or just things like that. Um, where you might pay up, but these go for a good price point, so it could be worth it if you can find them at a more reasonable price online. Or of course, um, you can just learn brands right now, and when we can be out thrifting again, you'll just know some more brands to be keeping an eye out for. So let's jump into this. It is going to be a three-part series. All week long, we are going to be talking about 10 dress brands per video. All of them are going to be ones with average selling prices of $90 or more. Dresses are just a really good category. They give you a higher price point than other things. I feel like shoes can be up there, but dresses are a lot more of a guarantee. So um, I honestly feel like I can do 30 more brands beyond this. There are just a lot of really good dress brands. So we're going to be doing 10 in this video and then 10 in the following videos. So that will be all week long. So you're going to have this one, which came out on Monday and we will have a Wednesday and Friday video with the additional 20 brands. So as usual, I leave up a tag photo here just so you guys can see that, recognize it. If you're ever out in a thrift store, you can recognize that tag. So first one for this video is Black Halo. Um, this brand has an average selling price of $97.71. It only has a 4% sell through rate and um, it has an average selling time of five days. So it's definitely a lower sell through rate, but this brand can get you top dollar, especially this is a brand that is well liked by Meghan Markle and people really like to follow her and what she wears. So if you ever can find a specific dress that she was seen wearing, that will get you a lot of money. Okay, next brand is Realization. They have an average selling price of $91.84, a 40% sell through rate and an average sell time of five days. Next one that's been on my bolo list for well over a year is Spell and the Gypsy. They have an average selling price of $112, a 42% sell through rate and an average selling time of six days. Um, Spell and Gypsy is a very bohemian brand, a lot of like flowy things. Um, I would say more maxi dresses, but definitely they're not limited to maxi dresses, just a very bohemian, like printed style. Next brand is Chasing Unicorns. They have an average selling price of $142.09, a 86% sell through rate and an average sell time of seven days. Number five is Retrofet. I believe that's how you say it, I'm not 100% sure. They have an average selling price of $240.46, a 59% sell through rate, and an average sell time of six days. Next is Self Portrait, a very popular brand right now. They have an average selling price of $126.12, a 23% sell through rate, and an eight day average sell time. Another one that I consider to be like a very hot brand right now is Love Shack Fancy. They have an average selling time of $186.69, a 44% sell through rate and an average sell time of seven days. And then number eight is Roge. Again, I could be saying that one wrong. This brand has an average selling price of $116.24, a 50% sell through rate and an average selling time of four days. 
Number nine is Cezanne, a French brand. They have an average sell price of $93.14, a 52% sell through rate, and an average sell time of five days. And the last brand that's gonna be in this video is Carolina Herrera. They have an average sell price of $143.07, a 21% sell through rate, and an average sell time of eight days. So those are the first 10 brands I wanted to talk about in this video. Like I said, there are gonna be 20 more, so keep an eye out for those videos this week. But this is just a great time to learn new brands. I don't think all of these are necessarily brands you would have never heard of before, and even in future videos. Like a lot of you have probably heard of Love Shack Fancy and Self Portrait, but I just really wanted to highlight brands that have this good selling price of $90 or above that you should be keeping an eye out for. So even if you already knew them, like it's not bad to get a refresher and knowing what price points you can expect for these different brands. So thank you guys so much for watching part one. Keep an eye out for two and three later this week. Or if you're watching this well beyond when it got uploaded, they might already be up. And if I remember, I will link the other two videos down below once they are posted. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to you later. Bye.